Scrap baby cosplay whip, I finished the leg. All that's left are misty tails and hearts. This is good or bad, but it's servo seems to be like getting stuck with uh, some stuff, you know. I will fucking destroy your bloodline, you fucking bitch! Hey everyone, little update of what's going on. Added some blood and rusting effects to the eyes. I got version 3 hands coming, which will be the long finger ones that hang off. And I got a second helmet being printed for my buddy Spring Bonnie here. Making a super realistic spring trap costume. Part 4. Painting the teeth. And making the jaw mechanism. Next step, painting to make it super dirty. I also bought real functional spring locks. I'll add them to the costume soon. It's actually pretty simple, so there's just like a, a stand right here, it goes up, oh, and then there's like a shelf here that the torso part sits on, kind of hard to tell, but just sort of sits on that, and then the pole goes all the way up into uh, this styrofoam head, so it's basically just a makeshift mannequin out of an old, uh, I think, fruit stand? I don't know. Uh, then basically the rest of him is just connected by buckles, so he's just sort of hanging limp there.
the Omega, everything in between. Shoot for the FNAF movie part one. And also, there's also a jaw tutorial. So, for the top, you put that inside the head and that is the jaw piece. And to connect it, you're gonna get these little cardboard pieces and put it through the jaw and connect it to the other piece. And have little pieces securing it in place with cardboard. And you get the string and you put it through so it can still move. But it can't be a tight string, it has to be one that actually is flexible enough to move. And that's your jaw. The fabric part is already being made, and the top hat is already done, but I did get second degree burn, so it may take a bit. I'm sick of seeing all these sinister faces, why am I working for minimum wage? In fact, I've been killing to give me a raise, why did they hire me? This is insane! We were playing in the sand, and you found a little band. You told me you fell in love with it, hadn't gone as I planned When you had to bid a tune Said you'd never love anew I wondered if I could hold Hey everybody, here's the next part of my Spring Bonnie cosplay tutorial. So I took an old torso that I had from my original Spring Bonnie that I had made a few years back, and then I started to glue on a new fabric color to match the head. I started to uh, cut out all the little bits and pieces for the withering. And then I actually used arms from one of my older cosplays because that wasn't getting much use. It was kind of old or uh, outdated. So I decided to update it, put on new fabric, and wither it to fit Spring Bonnie. I used uh, Daco's behind the scenes video to look at where the withering spots were on the Spring Bonnie suit. Then I did my uh, painting to make it look more decrepit and run down. And I added a bow tie, um, which was originally just from the dollar store, and then I added a purple fabric layer on it so that it would be closer to the movie version. And then I actually started adding spring locks. Um, I got a bunch of old scrap metal and junk from the thrift store, and then I started implementing it into the suit. Um, what you're seeing before you right here is uh, it used to just be a ring of metal, which I uh, bent and shaped into uh, fitting the neck hole of Spring Bonnie. And you can see more in the next part. Then three, then two, then one. Something happened when there was one. A little girl standing by herself. I was no longer myself. And I stopped singing. My stomach opened, and there was ice cream. I couldn't move, at least, not until she stepped closer. There was screaming for a moment, but only for a moment. Then other children rushed in again, but they couldn't hear her over the sounds of their own excitement. I still hear her sometimes. Why did that happen? Daddy. Let the other children go see her. Why won't you let me go? Here's a voice meant to deceive you. My voice just wants to leave you. This is more than a sick love story. Without you, I'd bring a shotgun to school. And I will if you want me to. For any reason, I hate that you leave when the lights come on. And if I had it my way, the fucking son would be gone.
Where am I? What was that? Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I just had a night. Hold up, Slickback. No, that's a pimp name, Slickback. That's what I said, Slickback. No, no, it's a pimp name, Slickback. Like a tribe called Quest. You say the whole thing. A pimp name, Slickback. It can't be called you Slickback for short. No, nigga, I'm a pimp named Slickback. Crystal, who is this person? Nigga, are you deaf? I'm a pimp named Slickback. Say it with me now. Ugly girls. Where would you go? I tell someone Who do you know? Come now, you're cleverer than that I'd find you in five seconds flat I'd use the key How would you get? Someday you'll see Is that a threat? Your family is looking for you Gregory! Gregory! Welcome to Mazer Size! Work out the calories while you eat!